All right. So hopefully Cascan can find his footing. Ooh, okay, yeah. So the biggest thing with Junior is, if you don't know the matchup, he can be like one of the most intimidating characters out there, just because there's so many things you're not used to. Like he's got traps with the Mecha Koopa. When he dies, side B's into you and then jumps on your shield, you may not be you may be unsure how to exactly punish it. Because like, if you hit the cart during the right animations, there is armor frames of it. Yeah. So it'll just go through and just like combo you instead. Yeah, uh, Junior also takes much less knockback and possibly damage. I'm not sure about damage, but it takes less knockback when he gets hit by uh, when he gets hit in the cart. Yeah, so yeah, so. Oh no, you can't be air dodging right into him. Yeah, you don't want to do that. Oh man, that was a really bad spot for him. Yeah, but now, now that Caskin's finally found his footing, we got uh, Captain actually panicking a bit, oh, and no. that should take it. Yeah. Yeah, that's definitely gonna take it. Yeah, All right, well, good stuff from Captain. Hopefully Kazkan can uh, show the level of momentum he got at the that little burst of momentum that he got at the end of that match. Yeah. Hopefully he can show that from the start this time around. It looked like he was definitely understanding how to play against the character a little bit better after uh, after that first stock, after taking off that first stock. Yeah, it's like the biggest things that people need to realize is that the disadvantage shade of Junior is actually like one of the worst. He yeah, has a very, very hard bad, time yeah. landing. It's fair. Uh, it's like a... Uh, Aerials aren't the greatest in the world. Up here's pretty good at juggling if he's below. Yeah. Fair and bear cover a good amount of space, and they aren't. They are. They're pretty quick for the most yeah. part. Yeah. They're pretty quick. And a slime as well. Oh. Um, pretty decent. But the biggest thing is that the clown cart. If he keeps side being on your shield for free, you need to punish that. Because if he's coming at you, you can just literally hit him out of it. Every That's time. true. I was gonna say that. I was earlier before the set started. I was gonna say I would think that uh, Fox would have a fun time in this matchup. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, this is uh, this should probably be like one of Junior's hardest matchups of anything. Yeah, I would believe so. Ooh, yeah, okay, definitely point. a turnaround from the last set, I mean, the last match. Um, Gaskin definitely found his footing. Yeah, understands. I think he kind of understands how to punish him better. The other thing too, the ca captain can't keep going above ledge like that because he's done it every single time. <gasps> he got the shield break. Not sure. That's not gonna kill, but I feel like he could have gotten something really sick yeah, off of that. I, I feel like somehow, I'm not sure, I don't know enough about Junior, but I feel like there could have been death <laughs> somehow, but. I don't think death, because there's no spike, but I feel like he could have gotten like 50% if you timed it. Maybe, yeah. Uh, like I know there's some, I know there's a kill confirm if you do get the shield break, where you um, you grab the Mecha Koopa cart, you throw it up, then you fork him into it, the Mecha Koopa hurts him, then you up B and kill him with the hammer. I, oh dang, that's like terrifying. Yeah. Oh man, he needs to be careful. Around, I do. Okay, I do know a little bit about Bowser Jr. Ooh, it's around okay. this percent. Ooh. Yeah, you're dead. Oh, not anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This, oh, oh, I barely missed that hammer there. Oh boy. Yeah, he's gonna start around this percent. He's gonna start looking for that side B to up B. The hammer throw. Okay, I actually didn't know that there's an action percentage for it. Oh, that, ooh, just a little bit off there. Now, that's something you don't really see too often. Junior's getting punished for going for their F smashes, but it's just Caskin's found the opening every single oh, Caskin's man. Oh, but as we say it, taking an F smash. Yeah. And the thing is, um, he hasn't been hitting F smash on Caskin's shield. When you hit it on shield, it's base. I, I think it's I think it's safe on shield. Um, this might be like maybe one character that can punish it. Yeah, the move is has very 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 little uh, ending lag. And there's a way that you can use down air where you actually oh don't land with any lag as well. Oh my god, stop down going it. for the high! Oh, oh no. man, he's gonna do that. Can't go above Fox. Never want to go above Fox. Because the thing is, like, once Kaskin realizes that Captain's going for the same high up B every single time, which I think he has, he can just literally F smash if he's dead. That's true, that's true. Yeah. For those who do not know, if you hit Bowser Jr. out of his up B animation, he cannot up B again. Yeah. So he'll be helpless without the car. And exactly. Uh, I think it takes, I, I forget the, how many frames it takes, but it does respawn after like a long period of time or when you touch the ground. Yeah, there are actually times where it, um, it comes back faster than other times. Other times it may not come back until you're at the bottom of the stage. I wish we had Trader here. Trader, you're in the <laughs> chat. Drop the knowledge, please. All right. Oh, okay, so it looks like you can use Dare, uh, Dare's landing hitbox as a frame one cancel right there. So you can use that to break out a certain combo, so. It's good that uh, uh, Captain was able to catch on to that. That's good awareness. Okay, that's safe. Okay, oh, right. now he crossed yeah, up that behind was, him. That was a very, that was very good patience from Cassian. Yeah. 
The bash running? Yeah. yeah. That's uh, like, you can't punish that. Yeah, yeah there we go. Yeah. Talking about that up smash again. Ooh, okay. Oh, narrowly catching him with the Mecha Koopa there. Finally getting more done with yeah. Such a gamble to... Um, oh, man. Here goes the Vortex. The Fox Vortex. Ooh. Oh, oh, such a oh, good wow, up air. Oh my goodness, the falling up air on the air dodge. Route. That was stale too. That was the other <laughs> thing to keep in mind. Oh man. Oh man, that's so unfortunate. That air box not hitting in front of him immediately to knock Haskin out of there. After such a convincing game one, yeah. Captain's struggling a little bit now. Oh, oh okay, he got right, it. There he goes, coming back. I mean, he keeps doing the same thing. Haskin yeah, really Kaskin, not catching yeah, on to Kaskin that. Kaskin definitely not punishing that. Oh man, taking that extra damage. Wow, the gutsy down air. Yeah. I mean, to be honest, it's normally worse to air dodge against uh, Fox it's true. than it is to just hopefully hit him. Yeah, and if that down air, I'm pretty sure that down air is disjointed. That's what you hit. Alright, good yeah, stuff. That is now, Bowser Jr. is very good at racking up damage. If he can just land two or three side Bs into an uh, aerial or a grab. The other thing too that I'm noticing is that Captain really hasn't been able to put Casket in any type of edge guard situation all that that's often. That's true. And that's kind of that's like one of the ways that uh, Bowser Jr. are definitely shine. It's that flare, that forward air should just knock Fox like way out of his arm. Just like way off stage, so he can't really do much about it. Oh no, he didn't land with oh, the auto cancel there. Not gonna die off of this though. Wow, that was a risky air dodge, but Casket. No, really that's, that's oh, it. Yeah, that's definitely going to this stock. Yeah. All right, good stuff to Casket. Yeah, and I mean, the other thing is, like, I feel like he finally realized what he needs to do with the matchup. Are we going to stream right now? No, go to Alicia. She'll tell you where to go. Okay, all right. Okay. All right, so all right. we both have to go, and we are going to be replaced with uh, Meow Mix and GDX. All righty. All right, catch you guys later. All right, guys, see ya.